Hi, my name is Gabriel and welcome to my channel. And today I want to show you the unboxing I did for the Omega Seamaster 300 Professional. This is a watch that means a lot to me because ever since I was a little kid growing up playing the James Bond games like GoldenEye, watching the movie, it's something I wanted to have ever since then. And now I get to have it. La 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 la. What is that? It's unboxing day. Well, thank you for dropping my box there. Are you happy, Daddy? Yes, I am. Today is an exciting day for me because I get to own a watch that I've been lost in for a very long time. That's right, the Omega Seamaster Professional 300. This is a watch I've been looking for a very long time, especially when GoldenEye came around. It was one of these watches that I must have, and today I do, by luck, and I'm very thankful for it. This will be kind of an unboxing experience, and I hope you enjoy. It's not the best one, but I want you to see this through my eyes. Thank you. As we can see, we have two boxes, one from Omega, one from Crown & Caliber. That's where I purchased the watch from. But for now, let's move this Crown & Caliber box aside and open the Omega box. Upon first impression, wow, this box is so shiny and it looks very, very nice. Here we have the documentations, uh, pictograms and, you know, with the model numbers and Insurance, I assume, and all that good stuff. Uh, pretty nice, pretty nice Omega. I'm very, very, very impressed. And the leather sleeve for the cards, and as I mentioned, uh, the instruction. I really don't care for these things, as I mentioned before in other videos. It's nice to know if there's something going on with the watch or something that you need to know, well, it's here. The texture and finishing on this box is superb. I don't think I have ever held a uh, watch box this heavy and well made. Uh, I never owned uh, a Rolex box, which I can't really compare it. And my Tudor boxes are definitely not done the way this one is done. I'm just very blown away about the quality of this box. Uh, it's awesome. So let's go ahead and try to open this baby, even though it has a little sticker on the butt. Wow. Well, the watch is not there. <laughs> How about that? I guess <laughs> that's the reason why they put two boxes uh, on the package. But yes, very nice, very nice quality. Uh, it's made out of leather for sure. I mean, I guess you can expect it to be that way, right? because you're paying that much money for a watch and um, well you know the box is pretty empty I don't really know what this is um, I've been pulling it well I don't want to damage that stuff but let me just leave it alone and yeah great great box great presentation well made thank you oh let me try uh, I don't know. you know what yeah forget it forget, forget about that but yeah, that's the box, pretty nice. Let me put this to the side and work on the other box. Well, that was the Omega box. Uh, let me put this to the side. Get over here. All right, Grand and Caliber, let's see what you got. Uh, very light box. Uh, let me open the sticker. There we go. And wow, that's nice, 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 uh, nice watch, Crown and Caliber. I like this pouch. Uh, let's see what this thing has. I assume it's my receipt and how much I spend. 
At least that's what I think. Yes, it is. There we go. And yep, let's put this back. I don't want to show the price or anything like that. I'm okay. <laughs> All right, nice watch, Crown and Caliber paper. And let's move on to this pouch. Wow, nice quality, nice stitching. And my colors, black and now orange is fine. But it's pretty nice. And wow. I mean, I'm sure you guys can really look at the quality. And I'm sure you guys seen this <laughs> watch so many times. So I figure I'll let you watch my point of view. Can you tell I'm overly excited? <laughs> well, now we got it out of the pouch. It's, uh, like I said, I wish you guys can see the quality. Uh, but I'm making the video this way. Now that I move this sticker, oh, look, there's a seal. All right. Some kind of number in there. I don't know what it is. Jeez. Look at this movement. This looks awesome. They're beautiful. Uh, I will be making some micro shots uh, for later videos. Uh, again, I said this was just kind of my unboxing, my experience opening the Omega. And I tell you, I'm very impressed. I'm very, very, very impressed about the quality of this watch. Uh, I cannot wait to play with it for some months before I can give you in that review. Maybe some weeks, maybe some weeks. So here we have the Omega Planet Ocean. It belongs to my friend Charles. Uh, he loaned it to me so I can make the video. Uh, coming up soon, I'll be making the review for this other watch. And let's put it on. Wow. I'm very impressed, very impressed on this watch. It's everything I hoped for and uh, definitely a keeper, definitely a keeper. And I'll be putting this on the strap in the near future and show you some guys, uh, probably some pictures or something like that later. So there we go, guys. That was my unboxing experience from Karan and Caliber of my Omega Seamaster Professional 300. Uh, very impressed with the presentation, very impressed how they send the items. I'm very impressed with their customer service. They're not paying me to do this review, nor I'm getting a sponsor for them. This is just a very genuine uh, unboxing experience to me, and, and I do appreciate doing business with someone that has so much care for their customers. Uh, Grand Caliber, thank you so much. And yeah, guys, I mean, this is a watch that I wanted since I was a kid, and now I have it, I get to enjoy it. And it's, it's actually my grail piece at the moment and hopefully more come, come in, in the future. But uh, if you have any questions, let me know. Please, if you like the video, subscribe, like the video, and let me know what you want to see next time. But until then, thank you so much and have a great day.